welcome back to the rock climbing channel in this week's vlog we are in the bk kino this is the latest addition to the bk gyms it's a rather small gym but a very fine one the main focus of the gym is training and in the background you can already see the huge spray wall it starts here on the right with a rather vertical wall then there is a 25 or 30 degree wall I guess and then it transitions into a I, I would say 50 degree wall then there is a huge or a large campus board over here with different size rungs and then there is also a coordination wall or yeah I think I could call it like that <laughs> um, for coordinative movements it's symmetrical so you can do different kinds of moves and apart from the spray wall and all the other training um, tools there is also a large uh, variety of hangboards so we have a beast maker 2000 here then two lattice rungs and some small edges 10 and 8 mil and then two more beast makers and also this really nice pulley system to um, adjust the intensity of the hangs for example if you do one armed hangs and you want to take some weight off your body so yeah I think this is pretty much everything you need to get strong and we really love this gym it's usually not very crowded it's only the training guys and girls here and yeah I, I can just highly recommend this gym if you're into training my plan for today is to do a test I will test my two rep max with um, wide pull-ups so not in a normal position but in a wide position I've never done this before I've tested my normal pull-up two rep max but never my wide pull-up two rep max so this is gonna be interesting for me as well and then I will climb a little bit on the moonboard so the plan now is um, to put some weight to my body <laughs> with this weight belt and then I will try to do two wide pull-ups and I will start at, a, at an intensity where I'm quite confident that I can do two wide pull-ups and then I will increase the weight until failure or yeah basically until I have my maximum total weight that's the plan Magima, Ali, Yavar, Gecha Gecha, come, 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 come Yavar, far good How did you feel? Yeah, it felt all right. I had to try reasonably hard. This was now at 35 kilos added. And I think I can do a little more. So I will have a short rest now, about two minutes. Then I think I will try to do it with 40 kilos added. Gimma, Gimma, come. Get you, get you, far good, get you. I don't know. Get you, Gimma, come on. This felt really hard. <laughs> I think this was close to my limit. Um, to be honest, the second pull-up was a bit debatable, I guess, if it, if it was a full pull-up or not. So I don't think I can go much higher, <laughs> or I don't know if I can go even higher. All right, so now I reviewed my own pull-ups on the footage, on the camera, and I'm not really happy with the form, especially with the last part. I think it's important to have full range of motion when doing this this kind of testing and for me the hardest part is definitely the last part and I think it was clearly visible that I could not really um, do the last part of the pulling motion so I won't even go higher than 40 kilos I think I'll try it once again with 40, 40 with 40 kilos Ali, get you. come come for good Gima come Ali, 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 Ali. Get you, get you. Come on, come on, come on. Ah. I'm still not really convinced about the form, especially of the second pull up. So I will go down a bit to 37.5 and try it again. <laughs> Ali. Come on. Get you, come. Yeah, get you, get you, get you, come on! 
Okay, I hope it was a little bit better. I think I'll take that. What are you doing there, Sarah? The same thing you did. Oh, but it's even more weight. Yeah, I know. I think you have 15, 25, 40, 55 maybe? Isn't that a bit much? No. All right. Feeling strong today? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, you can do that. <laughs> Where's the weight? Whoopsie. <laughs> Alright, the next problem is called Heart of Glitter and it was set by Ben Moon himself. So here it starts on a small crimp and then you have a second start hold, this wooden pinch and you go to this good white pinch then there is this wooden hold which is quite good for moonboard standards and the same wooden pinch once again, a small crimp this wooden hold and then the finishing jack So that was my beta matching this or did I match it now? <laughs> I don't even remember but what I know is I left out this crimp here this one here didn't really help for me
it's a bit of a tough session today to be honest um, I don't feel as strong as I would like to feel but yeah I think it's natural we all have these sessions and I try to to take it easy <laughs> and to laugh about it but sometimes I can get a bit grumpy um, nevertheless right now or just before that was really cool I could climb this um, one of one of these problems I, I don't remember the name it's, it's a 7b problem and it has these two really awkward moves at the, at the beginning which were always hard for me and I've tried this problem on and off for quite a while and I never could do it so considering that I don't feel that strong today um, I think it's a good sign that I still could do the problem it shows me in some way that I did progress throughout the last weeks and months because I have not climbed on the 2019 moonboard for a while now. Alright, so this is it for today's session. I hope you liked the insights. If you like this video, then don't forget to press the like button and subscribe. That would mean a lot to me. Um, the more people su subscribe to the channel, the higher my motivation is to, um, to upload more content like that. And I hope to see you soon again on the channel. You can always, of course, comment if you have some questions about my training or you can just leave a like, as I said. See you!